Yo, YouTube, what is up? My name is Daylan, and today we're going to watch the Nintendo Direct right now, today, and we're going to check this out. That's how I plug my headphones in. Damn, she got the yachts. I saw that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> she making me ink. This is how y'all Splatoon characters are. I ain't never played for two, never. <laughs> that shit was bad. Hello, everyone. I'm Shin hey, Takahashi, and I'll be your yeah, guide for today's Nintendo hell. You just saw a new trailer for Wave 2 of the Splatoon 3 Expansion Pass DLC, Side Order. This brand new story is set in the Spire of Order, where you will strengthen your character's abilities as you ascend the Spire's floors. We are developing this single-player DLC so it can be played over and over again. I like this setting. It's planned to release in Spring 2024, so please look forward to it. I went to DreamCon. Okay, let's see our first batch of Nintendo Switch headlines. hat. I even got the Splatoon poster as well. The toys are back in town. Fuck with it. Donkey Kong. Mario. Here we go. The rivalry that heated up on the Game Boy Advance system reignites on the Nintendo Switch system. With his eyes on the prize. Dream Kong shouts to Nintendo. Donkey Kong has stolen all the mini Mario I applied to y'all for um, part-time ambassador. And it's up to Mario but, to know, track him down. I didn't get it though. Yeah. Hey, In each stage, something. contraptions and other challenges await. No. Observation and action are vital to your success. Mario needs to reach the key, but he can't quite cross the gap. Hmm. Cross my gap. That monkey's tail looks a little suspicious, hey, though. What? BLM, BLM, BLM. If Mario does this, that monkey's what? Now he can get across. And safely oh, grab the key. Thought they were talking about Donkey Kong. Platform too high? Reach it with a handstand jump or a backflip. Like that, that was cool as hell. <laughs> Observe and act to collect mini Mario's, clear stages, it's kinda cool. and it's face like, Donkey Kong head um, on. Toll treasure or something. In this Captain updated version treasure of the game, you can play with a friend deep. in local co-op. However you choose to puzzle stuff. your way through, it's up to you to recover the toys. <laughs> Mario vs. Donkey Kong launches on That's Nintendo right, Switch cool. February 16th. Pre-orders begin see, today um, you know, on Nintendo eShop. A new Nintendo Switch, obviously, or new Save Nintendo the console. Prince and the world. Or um, a new Mario game. 3D Guide Mario game? Sargon as he sets off to save no. the Prince of Persia and restore the world's balance. Tapping into the roots of the Prince of Persia series, this game features 2D side scrolling action adventure gameplay. Dash through breathtaking environments in a mythological Persian inspired world, but don't linger too long if you hope to survive. Harness sword and bow techniques, as well as time powers to best these hostile I was gonna lands. Split this. As your journey Into progresses, Sargon will grow stronger and learn new like, abilities um, that expand his arsenal. You know, react to Equip stuff that I want to see. further boost your I'll abilities, up in the, among other perks. My YouTube video, but the number of amulets I might you can equip is all limited, this though. So one choose go, wisely. You know? Use everything at your disposal to navigate this harsh world and defeat the mythical beasts that stand in your way. Get ready to save the prince and discover the mysteries of Mount Calf. When Prince of Persia, The Lost Crown, launches on the Nintendo Switch system January 18th, you can receive the in-game Warrior Within outfit by pre-ordering the game from Nintendo eShop. All right. These games will help you chase your passions. Rev up for true arcade racing in Horizon Chase 2. Speed through stunning environments, each with its own dynamic right. art style, while overtaking your rivals on the road. Play the main campaign to unlock vehicles, courses, and more. You can also upgrade your vehicle and Listen, style it to fit your high-octane console. 
Itching for more racing I want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Nintendo Switch, but I don't want to buy it. Galaxy, Time your button presses sunshine, with the music to solve puzzles and Mario battle Odyssey, bosses. Like Over 30 thrilling tracks away, so including music from iconic Konami games. Super Mario Bros. Wonder. Up to four friends can battle it out in versus modes or jam together in local or online play. Super Crazy Rhythm Castle launches on Nintendo Pokemon Switch content. November 14th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Uh, okay. From school, creating a this, photo but... diary on weekdays. Yeah, spy you head to game? class, then enjoy family time in the evenings. On days off, you can visit all sorts of exciting places, like the beach or an art museum, in search of subjects to photograph. How will you spend your time with friends and family, and what kind of photo diary will you help Anya make? Spy Anya Operation Memories launches on Nintendo Switch next year. Imagine you got spoilers, Mario spoilers. <laughs> Mario's first RPG adventure returns. Hey, I'm pretty. The Super Mario in RPG this. game is back with updated graphics. Let's go over some new and returning gameplay features. Time your button presses with action commands to increase damage dealt or decrease damage received. When you time your attacks perfectly, you can now damage all enemies at once. Every successful action command will fill this gauge. When it's full, you can unleash the three-character triple move. Depending on your current party, the move will change, so experiment with different combos. During your adventure, you'll encounter bosses with colorful before. personalities. Honestly, I thought that after clearing the game, Bowser's you can fight some of them the again. First Mario RPG that but Bowser these powered-up bosses aren't gonna be easy. But apparently not. Literally, I'm pretty sure it's just the first Mario RPG. Literally, the first RPG Bowser was like, "Yo, set off for adventure with Mario. Mario and friends." When Super Mario RPG launches on the Nintendo Switch system November 17th. Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. Nah, that's fire. Hey. Uh, uh, hey, yo. Look Come alive. We're almost there. Uh, <sighs> the Nintendo DS game, Trace Memory, returns on the Nintendo Switch system as another code to memories. One day, a young girl named Ashley receives a letter from the father she thought had passed away. Seeking answers, she sets off for the solitary Blood Edward Island in search of him. Once there, Ashley encounters puzzles and obstacles that hinder her investigation. Can you? Oh, she's talking. She also oh, meets a mysterious like boy. Yo, these, these, like, what truths await Ashley in this place? Like, and no matter how hard I try, I can't remember Dad's face. Kind of crazy. Who are you? The sequel, Another Code R, Journey into Lost Memories, previously unreleased in North America, is also included. So this is like Juliet, huh? Play both games to experience the full story. Unravel both adventures, fully enhanced for Nintendo Switch. I don't when another code recollection launches game. January 19th. Pre-orders begin <laughs> today on like, Nintendo damn, they got a sequel now. Another code recollection in includes DS two era. games: the Nintendo That's DS crazy. game Trace Memory and its Wii sequel, which was never released in North America. Both games are fully enhanced oh, on sorry. Nintendo it Switch. Just wasn't released Please look America. forward to playing them early next year. Next, please take a look at this. Thought they just made a sequel. I guess not. <laughs> Hold on. 
One day, a loyal toad presented a flyer advertising a show at the Sparkle Theater. Princess Peach and some toads went to go see it, but then... The wicked grape and the sour bunch suddenly made their grand entrance and took center stage. Word. Now it's up to Peach and the theater's guardian Stella to save the play and the day. Oh, this is the new Princess Peach game. Okay. This perfect performance has become a terrible tragedy. Luckily, Peach can use the power of Stella's ribbon to face off against the sour bunch. The ribbon alone won't always cut it, though. So let's do this. All right. I feel like it's been a while since Whoa. we got a... Peach transformed into Sword oh, Fighter shit. Peach. <laughs> By transforming, like she can use fantastic show-stopping abilities. Peach. Fend off the Sour Bunch Game. with sensational sword so play. Like Super Princess Peach or something. <laughs> Can Peach save this performance and its performers? I'll play something out on my cousin's DS. There are more stolen cool. shows to save. I think I'm Valuable games. artifacts from this museum Mainly have gone Mario missing. Games, Become Detective Peach, investigate clues, and track down who done it. Desserts have been snatched from this sweets festival. Turn into Patissier Peach and save it from a sugar crash. The Sour Bunch got their hands on this martial arts school. Become Kung Fu Peach and take it back from these foul fiends. Uh, <laughs> these outfits kind of crazy. She like Chun Li. Many other transformations are. Why does he have a mop head? Many other transformations are just behind the curtain. The stage is set. Our leading lady is ready for the spotlight. Princess Peach Showtime makes its debut on Nintendo Switch March 22nd. Pre-orders begin Yo, today on Nintendo eShop. That was a new look at Princess Peach Showtime. In Peach's latest cool. adventure, the gameplay changes depending on her transformations. It looks like there are more transformations beyond the ones we showed today, so please stay tuned. Let's continue with some more headlines. All right. What we got, what we got, what we got. A new saga begins. A multi-layered RPG full of rich stories awaits in Saga Emerald Beyond. I'm skip ahead. I did, there are like, six here. Down a mysterious organization, okay. voice and body, okay. and a king of darkness much, who was recently reawakened. Select a hero, then follow their journey through 17 interconnected worlds as they strive to achieve their goals. How the story unfolds is in your hands. The choices you make can unlock different paths, more than ever before seen in the saga franchise. Fight in timeline battles, turn-based combat in which turn order is crucial to victory. Use special techniques to control the order of actions or activate team combos to swing the tide of battle in your favor. Saga Emerald Beyond launches on Nintendo Switch next year. The Legendary Raider returns. The first three Tomb Raider games, all with upgraded visuals, are venturing onto Nintendo Switch in one daring collection. As the fearless archaeologist, Lara Croft, you'll travel the world and face off against deadly foes Wait, and did, even did you deadlier just say Lara? legends. Huh? Climb, Isn't that Lara? backflip, and swan dive through perilous uh, quests spanning different countries and now. mythologies. <laughs> yeah. Backflip along the way, this era? you'll solve Whoa. puzzles to uncover treasures you know, of the ancient era, world you know? and she unravel mysteries lost to the yeah, ravages of time. Too. This faithfully remastered trilogy comes with all of the expansions and secret levels for each game. You can also toggle between the original polygon look and the upgraded visuals at any time. 
<laughs> Tomb Raider 1 through 3 Remastered, starring Lara Croft, launches on the Nintendo Switch system February 14th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. This detective's got a second bolt of brilliance. Every great detective starts their day early. This is Rhyme City, a place where humans and Pokemon coexist. The detective duo of Pikachu and his partner Tim investigate various cases while searching for Harry, Tim's missing father. Tim interviews people, Pikachu interviews Pokemon, and they find the truth together. They'll also rely on other Pokemon to broaden the scope of their investigations. Follow Sense with Growlithe. Smash Rocks with Darmanitan. And Peer Through Walls Luxray. with Luxray. Can Tim and Pikachu solve all the mysteries and find Harry? Find out when Detective Pikachu returns. Launches on Nintendo Switch October 6th. Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. This game's a real toot. Raise your brass for the quirky rhythm game, Trombone Champ. Play the notes in time with the music as best I you can. I asked whoever playing this. But how you play what that board is up to you. You can use gyro controls to adjust the pitch up and down. Or the IR motion camera on the right Joy-Con controller. I'm not gonna lie, this might be harder than... The controls are... <laughs> Pretty the unique. Will hold you. <laughs> and mastering every control scheme won't be a walk in the park. Hell no. Honk it's your way through nearly 50 songs spanning various genres, from classical to electronica and everything in between. There's no way it has Plus, to sort by different from classical to it, I feel like it's already hard. <laughs> electronica the fact that and you have to everything the, in between. The joystick Plus, itself. up to four musicians can band together in local multiplayer. I just ran the box in the background. Trombo and those Switch games. Now, Beat Saber and Guitar Herbal. <laughs> Ten teams of three will duke it out for survival in this online battle like... royale brawler. Knock your opponent's health down to zero and deliver a finishing blow. Or shove them off the collapsing terrain to win. Choose from 15 heroes, each inspired by a different mythology. Work with your allies to be the last team standing. Battle Crush is free to play and launches first for consoles on Nintendo Switch next spring. A closed beta test will be available this October. Lead your mercenaries to fame and fortune in this open world tactical RPG. Take up various contracts from protecting townsfolk from thieves to vanquishing the land's most notorious figures. Before battle, equip your mercenaries with the best gear and skills to claim victory and live to see another day. Up to four players online can jointly command a troop and journey together across this vast world. War Tales launches as a timed console exclusive on Nintendo Switch later today. Run and gun in this reimagining of the beloved NES classic, Contra. Blast through explosive stages with a devastating arsenal of weapons to crush the Red Falcon forces. Spring into action with easy pick up and play controls and a variety of difficulty options. This reimagining from Konami and Way Forward features new weapons, enemies, powerful super attacks, and a four player co op mode. Contra. Operation Galuga storms onto the Nintendo Switch system early next year. Liberate your kingdom. Reclaim your destiny. Tis a grievous tale which speaks of Fevrith, one of stolen destinies, stolen minds, and stolen nations. That's a grievous Yet as the world stands consumed by immense evil, a fallen prince shall rise again 
Ring of legend lighting his path. That is the Ring of the Unicorn, ancestral treasure of Cornea's royal lineage. Legend speaks of your ancestors wielding it to purify evil. Yet the answer is clear as day now. The path before us is laid bare, and all that remains now is to walk it. Walk it, I will, mother. Um, I was gonna make a joke. Freely traverse about an expansive um, world. Final Fantasy. Gather new allies. Then I saw the name And lead the liberation is that a to glorious victory. Cultivate a grand army Final of Fantasy sixty 16. unique characters, from humans and elves you know. to massive beasts and heavenly angels. Today marks our first foray into the mists of despair which hang heavy over our home. It may take days, months, or even years, but I shall see the duties of my bloodline fulfilled. Atlas and Vanillaware present the rebirth of tactical fantasy RPGs. Unicorn Overlord. Available March 8th, 2024. Scooby Doo? No, Luigi Mansion. Yeah, I know it. Uh, remake. New game. Where are we going? Luigi's Mansion 2 HD. Okay, upgrade. Welcome to Evershade Valley, a place that's screaming and teeming with the supernatural. Luigi, our faint of heart hero, was sent here to check it out. Time for some mansion how many, mayhem. How many Luigi mansions are there? There's three, right? No spooky adventure is complete without this vacuum like device, <sighs> the Poltergust. Use it to light up dark areas, vacuum up objects, and interact with the environment. It's a handy tool for your paranormal escapades. Paranormal. Plus, when you spot a ghost, pop! You can stun them with the strobe ball. Then vacuum them up. You can even grab multiple ghosts at once. In this game, you'll find ghosts haunting, a former plant research lab, a broken down clock factory that's full of sand, a mine covered in ice and snow, and even more places. These troublemakers will use every trick in the book to block your path. Can Luigi summon his courage and save the day? Looking for other ghost hunters? Up to four players online can do some exercise Bro. across different multiplayer that lag modes. Was crazy. I ain't Luigi's Mansion 2 HD creeps onto Nintendo Switch next summer. How was that? Next, we have two announcements to share. First, please take a look at this video. Uh, Super Mario Show? Movie? I don't know. <laughs> because the first Super Mario movie was such a hit, we're gonna make a What's new that? one. Another one. It's a large question block. Actually, this question block currently appears on the roof of the previously announced Nintendo Gallery that's under construction uh, in Mario Uchi City, action. Kyoto Prefecture. The official name of this gallery will be the Nintendo Museum. Okay. At the Nintendo Museum, a wide variety of Nintendo products from the company's history will be displayed. Construction is going well, and we plan to finish up by March 2024. That's cool. We'll share more information, such as the opening date, at another time. Please stay tuned. Next, we'd like to share some updates on upcoming Amiibo figures. The Zelda and Ganondorf Amiibo figures are releasing on November 3rd. An Amiibo figures of Noah and Mio from the Xenoblade Chronicles 3 game will be released as a set on January 19th, 2024. And finally, we have a new Amiibo figure to announce. The DLC fighter from Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, Sora from Kingdom Hearts, is on the way. 
With the release of Sora, everyone is here from Super Smash Bros. Ultimate in amiibo form. Please look forward to its release next year. That's all for today's amiibo announcements. Next, please take a look at this. What we got? Zero game Probably. returns as a 99 player battle royale. F Zero 99. I know this game. Race on classic F Zero oh, courses with machines from the original Super NES game. Tear through courses in high speed races, but be careful. Your power eh, meter will fun. decrease more if you crash better. into pilots or guardrails. If it hits zero, you're out. You'll need to avoid collisions and conserve your power meter to stay in the race. Feeling risky? Spend people. some of your power meter for Racing. a temporary speed boost. You can also collect super sparks, which appear when machines collide, to boost up to a special path called the Skyway. It's your best chance at bypassing your rivals hey, yo, and cheating. jumping into a higher position. <laughs> oh, heck no. Complete goals while boy, you're racing to unlock cosmetic to options for your machine. Ninety-nine players, one winner. It's time to race your way to first place. Because F Zero Ninety Nine will be available exclusively for active Nintendo Switch Online members later today. More than 30 years after its original release, F-Zero is back as a battle royale game. This title also supports the Super NES controller available exclusively for Nintendo Switch Online members. We hope you will give it a try and aim for first place. Okay, let's continue with some more headlines. More headlines. One little hero, one humongous Didn't he say problem. there was two more? What? He Welcome to Vandal City, a whimsical land inhabited by it. small fuzzy Whatever. beings called Yordles. After a party gets a little too wild, the portals holding the land together collapse and throw everything into chaos. It's up to you and your knitting magic to stitch Vandal City back together journey across the land to gather materials and craft items and meals for the locals. As you continue gathering and crafting, you can weave together new upgrades by unlocking more branches of the skill tree. Enchant your experience even further by embarking on quests and hosting festivals for the community. Can you save Vandal City? And what mysteries will you discover during your magical adventure? Vandal Tale, a League of Legends story, launches on uh, Nintendo Switch next year. Wait, did you hear that? Yeah. Join best friends, Nunu and Willem, on a journey across the frozen wilds of the Freljord. Jump, climb, and sled your way through a beautiful yet treacherous land, where every step taken and each puzzle solved will bring you closer to the truth about these friends and their past. Song of Nunu, a League of Legends story, launches on the Nintendo Switch system November 1st. League of Legends story is. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. What's going on here? Let's move into formation. Trip with these chumps yeah, and feel like a prize. Ah. Hey, yeah. Greetings, welcome to the island. This tropical resort contains tons of micro games that'll get your body moving. Hey, yo, what you In each micro game, okay, you'll sure. get into a specific pose called a form. That's Copy it. the form shown, then a form. Nintendo, what is that? Ah, oh, heck no. Nah. <laughs> Copy the form shown, then perform the correct they action did not have as to quick put as you can. No buck back. The crazy, micro games will come one after another, That's so crazy. look alive. 
Plus, up to four players can battle it out in party mode. Reach the goal without getting caught by Medusa. Free. Or settle the score in an arena to be the last one posing. With over 200 lightning fast micro games and multiplayer so modes aplenty, everyone's in for a wacky time. WarioWare Move It. Bro, I thought on Nintendo, Nintendo was like, you everyone's know, in for a wacky PG time. WarioWare but... Move It launches That's on the crazy. Nintendo Switch system November 3rd. Pre orders are available Long now. Leg. A heroic. That's Lead an crazy. army of over 100 heroes into battle and put an end to an empire's invasion. Meet Noah, do have a humble Netta. villager. Sane, an officer from the Empire. And Marissa, a forest guardian. These three Marissa band together wins. to fight for a common goal. On their journey, they'll meet a variety of heroes who can join their cause. This is your home base, known as the Headquarters. As allies join you, additional facilities will become available. You'll be able to tend crops, open shops, and more. Each hero you encounter has their own backstory and motivation. They may not always get along at first, but these conflicts may strengthen the bonds between your heroes. Trust, betrayal, justice, and truth. A heroic tale will begin when Ayudin Chronicle 100 Heroes launches on Nintendo Switch April 23rd. Participate in some pixel perfect play. Next stop, Octopia. Travel to a charming parallel world in this paid DLC for Eastward. Help Sam and John turn the pages of a new chapter as they adjust to country life in a mountainside village. Tend to livestock, whip up culinary delights for your neighbors, and restore buildings to help the village thrive. And if you're new to Eastward, don't worry. You can access the DLC even if you haven't played the main story. Eastward Octopia ventures onto Nintendo Switch this holiday. Get back into the groove. In this sequel to War Groove, charge across three tactical campaigns with valiant factions, including a new mouse folk faction, the Fari. Plus, you can now supercharge your commander's groove to unleash devastating attacks. Lead a roguelike offensive in conquest mode. Battle friends locally or online. Or create and share your own cutscenes and campaigns. War Groove 2 marches onto Nintendo Switch as a console exclusive October 5th. Get out of my way! Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Dive and catch fish by day. Then serve them as sushi by night in the aquatic adventure, Dave the Diver. Use the fish you've caught to concoct recipes and create the day's menu. Then tend to the clamoring customers at your sushi restaurant. Explore an ever-changing underwater world to find the best ingredients and strive to exceed culinary expectations. What? Dave the Diver launches first for consoles on the Nintendo Switch system October 26th. Pre-orders and a free demo swim onto Nintendo eShop later today. The final wave is racing in. Here's All a right. sneak peek at Wave 6, the final wave of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC. From the Mario Kart Wii game, Daisy Circuit. More returning characters are also being added in Wave 6. From the Mario Kart Double Dash game, Diddy Kong. From Mario Kart Wii, Funky Kong. And from the Mario Kart Tour game, Pauline. And also, Peachette. Huh? Who's Peachette? Wait, hold on. Ooh. Yeah. 
Oh, Wave that six of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe uh -huh. Booster Course Pass DLC. Active Mario Kart 8 Deluxe game drives onto Nintendo Switch this holiday. Active Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack members can enjoy this DLC at no additional cost. The DLC can also be purchased on its own. Something new is among us. I haven't played Mario Kart in a while. Just so let y'all know I'm the best Mario Kart player ever. It is what it is, you know? No, for real, I'm, I'm literally the best Mario Kart player ever. I haven't played in a while. Like a long time. Mungus got new content? <laughs> What's going on here? I know there's some people that still play Among Us. Finally they got new maps. This new map for Among Us is free and launches this October. Only on Nintendo Switch? What did you think? Or everywhere. Thanks for sticking with us this far. Next up, we'd like to recap some of the previously announced Nintendo titles you can look forward to playing from September onwards. Let's take a look. They got a lot of bangers, I ain't going with you. We hope you're looking forward to these upcoming titles. This next video will be our last announcement. Oh. Please take a look. Let's see what you all got. Paper Mario? No, it's not. <laughs> Imagine. Oh, 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 no! There is no way! Oh, I was joking! Wait. Oh, okay. Wait, hold on. Okay, I thought this was gonna be something new. Oh my god. Or like the remake or something, or maybe it is, I don't know. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god, bro. You know what's crazy? I had a... I had a Wii and a GameCube. Well, I didn't have a GameCube, but I had a GameCube port to put in the Wii so I could play GameCube games. And I tried to get um, the original Paper Mario 64, the Paper Mario 64, but I couldn't. They didn't have it, so I had to play this game, which I didn't want to buy, but it was pretty cool, though. It was pretty cool, but I really wanted to play Paper Mario 64. Maybe I'll play this. Not this game, but Paper Mario 64. I don't know. What do y'all think? Let me know in the comments down below. I like. Which Paper Mario do y'all like? Super Mario. Super Mario Paper, no, Super Paper Mario, or Paper Mario Thousand Year Door, or Paper Mario 64, or any other Paper Mario that came out.
I think he's just about to be adorned. He has probably the year. Damn. I thought it was Paper Mario 64 as well. The game was actually kind of, kind of cool, but you know, 64 favorite. The best one in my opinion. Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door, originally released on Nintendo GameCube, will return with enhanced graphics. Whether you played the original or have yet to play it, we hope you'll look forward to experiencing this adventure in a paper world starring Mario and friends. Man, I love the guy. I mean, I'm still hyped for this, but thank you for watching. I wish they would have did Paper Mario 64. Oh my gosh. Why? Why? Gosh damn it. Nah, W. W Direct. From Nintendo. Damn. But, y'all. That is it for this video, y'all. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like in this video. Subscribe for more content. Let me know down in the comments down below. What was your favorite? Uh, you know, your favorites reveal in this direct. So, yeah, anyways, that is it for this video. I have a gaming channel, y'all could subscribe to that as well. Mr. Dallas is gaming. I also have a main channel, which I'm not uploading too much on that, but you know, I'm gonna start uploading more on that channel. You know, also on the gaming channel, I'm gonna start playing Mortal Kombat 1, the story, obviously. Probably some multiplayer, of course. But, yeah. Look out for that as well. But I gotta fix my PS5 first, though. That might take a while. But, anyways, that is it. Hope you all enjoy your day. And that is it. Peace!